Hi, I'm Danielle Fischel. When I was a child, I was a child actor. And now that I'm an adult, I'm an adult actor. This is my fiance. No, not him. This is my fiance. So now that I'm engaged, I'm basically a pro. So I'm here to answer all of your relationship questions. Dear Danielle, Danielle's dating diary. Let's dive into some Danielle mail, shall we? Dear Danielle, I want to ask the boy I like to prom. Do you think it's too forward? Well, I have a little story for you. When I was a senior in high school, I asked my boyfriend at the time if he would go to prom with me because my boyfriend at the time was Lance Bass. So I had to make sure his schedule would allow for prom. Unfortunately, he told me no because he was going to be in Japan and I was so sad. And then about a week later, I got three dozen roses in the mail with a card that said, plans have changed, I'll be in town, can I take you to prom, check yes or no. And there were two little boxes. So of course I checked box yes and then I realized I probably also needed to call him so I called him and said yes over the phone and a couple weeks later we were at prom together dancing it up. What's up Lance, hey? So my words of wisdom are it is always okay for a girl to ask a boy to prom and you never know you just may find yourself in the arms of Harry Styles. And here's another great question from one of our viewers. Dear Danielle, I recently met my boyfriend's family for the first time, which was a big step. I want to get to know them better, but I don't want to come on too strong. Any advice? Well, my best advice is to just be yourself, but to try and find a common interest with someone. So say his mom. If you guys are both into shopping or cooking or sports or reading, try and find something that you guys both share in common and then tell her what your favorite part of that activity is. And another good piece of advice is that never go over to their house empty handed. I always think it's nice when someone's hosting an event at their house for you to bring a little gift. So if she likes candles, bring her a candle. If you're old enough to buy a bottle of wine, bring a bottle of wine. So. Those are two first steps that I would do. And here's a little something to leave you with. Dear Diary, today we learned some valuable lessons. First, boyfriends can come and go, but a friendship can last forever. And if somebody doesn't return your affection, don't worry. There are plenty of fishel in the sea. <laughs> Wink. Anyway, just remember, you may be only one person in this great big world, but someday you may also be the world to one person. Love you more. Danielle. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to Pop Sugar Girls Guide for my endless love advice.